Hey, what's going on, everybody? What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? Yeah, I got um, some things that I would like to talk about. And what I want to talk about is bullying. And bully, bully, bullying is not good at all. And you should not be, you know, bullying anybody if you are doing anything like that because it's not right and you shouldn't do it no 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 you shouldn't do it at all because it's not right would you want someone bullying you or anybody that you love or anything like that no what if someone that you love like your sister or, or someone you know like that you would not want them to be bullied no not at all so why would you bully you know anybody you shouldn't do it yeah oh hey where you come from i didn't know you you were around well i i i, I like uh you know your show because it's really 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 and truly a good thing because you're awesome oh thank you i didn't pay you to say that no but you really and truly you are you're always talking about great things. Oh, wait a minute. My first love woke me up this morning with a smile all on my face. Hey, um, why are you singing that song? Oh, I am listening to it all day. It's a wonderful song. You know what? Can you play it for me, please? And just a little taste of it, because I really enjoy that song. My first love. Okay, let's do that. Okay, should be coming up. Hey. About your first love. How your first love is here to stay sure. You know, my first love makes me feel real special too. Let me know you can fix it in your first love. Can you change your first guy's doom? I have to tell you about mine. Because it is so true. My first love. My first love. With a smile on my face and sent me on my way. My first love. My first love. Yeah, y'all. Sing it. My first love. Kept on the danger. Helped on my way. My first love. Get it, y'all. My first love. My first love. I bet you thought that I was talking about a woman. But a woman is only flesh and blood and it is looking for the heavenly feeling my Jesus because Jesus is the Hallelujah. Okay, okay, let's let's, let's talk. Let's talk. I wanna talk about I wanna talk about what you were talking about earlier. What's that? Bullying. Oh bullying? Yeah, bullying. Yeah, bullying is not good. I had an incident happen to me today on the playground at school. But actually, it happened before the playground, actually. It really and truly did. I was sitting at my desk, and all of a sudden, I get oops upside the head. That was a song we heard, wasn't it? Yes, it was. 
And so, I, you know, was like, whoa, I turned around, and there was this great big old guy, he was bigger than I was, because he was real big. And so, I, you know, raised her hand and told the teacher, and she told me, quit being a tattletale. And so, I was like, when something happens to you, you told me to tell the teacher, right? Yes, I did. And so I did. And so she did it two more times, and I raised my hand again twice and told the teacher. And so she told me, didn't I tell you to stop being a tattletale? If you do it again, I ain't going to put the duck's head on you, and you're going to eat in the corner. And everybody's going to eat laughing at you. And so he hit me again. And what you do? I didn't want to be in the corner. <coughs> Are you all right? Yes, I am. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay. So you're on a playground, right? Gotta be careful who you messing with. You couldn't be messing with one of the king's kids, right? Right, true. So what happened was he was playing baseball. And I no, we are no, I'll take that back. We are playing football. So he got thrown the ball. And so, he was standing by me. And he threw the ball. So, what I did, I tackled him. Because he was tackled football, right? Right. So, I let him have it hard. And so, he hit the ground. And he started coughing like you was. And so, he uh, started breathing heavy. You know, like asthma thing. And so I saw a cord hanging out in the pocket. So I pulled it out. I knew what it was. And his inhaler. So I put his inhaler and gave it to him. And it helped him. And I helped his so I helped him get back up. And he was like, oh, wow, man. He said, the way I've been treating you lately, he said, and you, you know, help me. He said, wow. I really appreciate that. And now we are the best of friends. See, I could have just let him stay there, but I didn't. Do unto others as you want others to do unto you. Because, see, we all are God's children, and we are all what God wants us to be. So we just got to work on ourselves, and he the best you, you can be. And I found out something else. I asked him, I said, do you want yourself? I thought about it, because I thought about what you be asking people. Do they love themselves? Oh, you be paying attention to me. Yes, I do. I pay close attention to you. So he said, no. So I said, but you follow me into the bathroom, okay? And he said, Okay, and so I said, look in the mirror. I said, and tell yourself that you love you and you're great and you're awesome too. And he looked at me all cockeyed, right? And so I said, no, it's all right. So I did it. I said, Jordan, I said, you're awesome. You're great. I said, you're becoming greater and greater and greater every day. In every way, because God is in the midst of you, and you shall not be moved, and God shall help you in that right early. And he was like, Oh, I feel power if you do that, so I'm going to do it. So he got in the mirror, and he did it too, and he was on fire. And he was like, Thanks. He grabbed and hugged me and said, Jordan, I really apologize to you because now I love myself.
And so I want to kick it with you anymore. And anything or anybody, all you do, let me know and I'll get them for you. Now, no one else bothers me at all. Because they see me and him are tight. Yeah. Okay, well, I know it's late. Holy, I'm getting tired. Okay, everybody. All right, everybody. In the name of Jesus and the blessed Holy Spirit, we will be talking with you later. And remember, keep God first. Talk to God. And what else should they do, Jordan? Read the Bible every day, even if you just listen to it on your phone. And they have apps for that. Let me show you something, everybody. See? Numbers 3. These also are the generations of Aaron and Moses in the day that the Lord spake with Moses in Mount Sinai. And these are the so names of the sons of Aaron. Girls, Always, and ladies and gentlemen, always listen to the wise world. Yes, listen to the wise world. And it is very awesome to listen to because God knows that you are putting first the kingdom of God so all things can come unto you. And you, and you, 